Hello everyone, welcome to a new Let's Play. Today we're going to be starting Aspire Ina's Tale. This is a game from some developers that I have seen a game from before, but I haven't actually played it. But this game looks beautiful. I love the art and it's a cool little puzzle platformer, so right up my alley. Let's go ahead and hop in, except for the puzzle part. Mostly just because I'm awful at puzzles. I like them. But people have to suffer me actually solving them. <laughs> Beyond a silvery sea of shattered machinery stands a spire, the tower. Mm -hmm. Bright and fickle, its spindly metal structure bends rhythmically as though it were breathing. Ooh, I don't want to skip. Most importantly, inside the tower there is a heart. Yeah, like Slay the Spire. It beats, as all hearts do. But instead of blood, it pumps out the dreams of the young girl sleeping within. And there she might lie, were it not for a knight in shining armor. But this isn't a story about how the girl was saved. This is the story about how she discovered she could be so much more. Hmm. I've seen their first game. I don't really know what it's about. I wonder if their first game is about the knight saving this girl that's locked in the tower. And this is a sequel, and now we're playing as the girl we saved. But this game looked too cool to not play. Oof. That music. Am I free? No, still inside. Stop dreaming, Inna. It's time to wake up. It's time to go home. Wow, that's a giant sword, by the way. Yeah, so you were dreaming, and this machine was- this tower was pumping out your dreams to everyone else so they had to experience your dreams. Interesting concept. That must be the sword of the night. Am I tiny? Or what? Or is that sword just massive? Was the person that saved us massive? Yeah, the art in this is immediately very beautiful. I mean, when I saw it on the page, it reminded me of Grizz. Grease, which is also a gorgeous game. I like your little jump line. Here! <laughs> Adorable. <laughs> is that a checkpoint? I think that's a checkpoint, though. Okay. Everything else is in ruins, but these panels, they're still standing. Resisting, are you? Just like home. Just like Kamura. I hope I can resist, too. You're still standing, still resisting. You hope you can resist, too. Can we get a name drop there? Kamura? Kamura? Probably butchering that pronunciation. Okay, I immediately see a box that I imagine we have to push. Or pull. Okay, X is the button. <clears throat> I was try pressing A in front of it, but no, that would make sense, because A is the jump button. You have, a, you have a really massive braid, by the way. And you do the thing that I love if every platformer protagonist does it. You can actually grab ledges. I hate when platformer protagonists can't grab ledges. It's so ingrained into my brain that they should be able to. But they don't. Also, that rhymes. I'm dropping my new album soon. Get ready for it. Okay. Push. Push box. Down here. Whoa, is that the Monado down there? Looks like it could be. I imagine if I walk in front of this, something's gonna happen? No. Surprisingly. Okay. I don't know, that seemed like... I don't know, I was gonna walk in front of it and see my reflection, but it's an evil version of me. And then I have to fight battling. Alrighty. There's that. Gonna hop up there, please. Thank you. Got some cracks on the wall here. 
If this were a Zelda-like, I'd say I need to bomb this later, but I don't think there'd be anything in it. Or if it was Metroid, I guess. Electricity? What is that? Hi? My, what many eyeballs I think you have. Looks like you're... This is like a force field. I thought it was electricity, but it looks like it's just keeping up the force field so you can't get out, maybe? Is that potentially a product of one of your dreams, Inna? Have you unleashed a monstrosity on this world? That's the crazy thing about the idea of someone's dreams being able to manifest in the real world, is what kind of nightmarish stuff will pop up. Like... I can think of some of the stuff in my dreams, and I'm like, man, that'd be really nightmarish if it was in real life. Inna apparently has that power. And this must be really weird for you. You're gonna actually have to see the effects of what was happening to you. I almost said what you did, but... You didn't do it. Someone trapped you here against your will, apparently. Okay. I don't know if I had to hold that down the entire time. I was expecting it to be a timed door. I love this little prance that you have with your stick legs. Once again, reminds me of Grizz. Big robot. I was kind of staying quiet there because the music was swelling, so it felt like in a an important moment. Just wanted to be able to take that in for a few seconds. Yeah, that was like a big, or maybe that wasn't a robot. Maybe that was the night. Could be. Wait, is your hair okay? Where's the rest of it? Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought it got chopped off or something. Honey, I thought being awake would hurt a lot more. Yeah, how are you like, like emaciated and incredibly hungry? Maybe they were pumping you full of nutrients or something. Alright. Hop. Jump. There's another giant hand with a sword. Huh. I wonder if I could have swung on that. Like a rope. Like, you know, a rope swing. Because this looks like I just barely made it. Okay, more of you. So maybe that one we saw in there wasn't the knight that saved us. Maybe this is what you had to fight through to get to me. Oh, that's so cool, the reflections in the crystals. This is it. This must be the way to Kamura. See, it's like Papa used to say, all it takes is the first step. Into the darkness, and all alone. It's okay, Inna. I'm with you. And... Sure, I'm pretty mediocre, but uh, I'll try and help as best I can. Ooh. Hello, cool music. Okay, that was really cool. I gotta say, in the 10 minutes I've been playing, the OST has been knocking it out of the damn park. Home runs all day. Because, yeah, this music is very hype and very chill and very whimsical all at the same time. Which is not something I thought I would ever say. Okay, more puzzles. So, if I had to guess... We need that thing up there, and that, like, light that it's putting out dispels this evil stuff right here. Hmm. So I need to get over there. Can I make the jump from this side? I do believe I can. I feel like something's gonna start chasing me out of this giant shadow door here. Like, something's just gonna walk out like a giant and be like, Hey, what are you doing? Okay, you can swing on these. Good to know. I'm glad I learned that now. Alright, pick you up. And go down here. Whoop. 
Pick it up. There we are. Yeah, that's about what I expected. Go away, darkness. Oh, and you, like, charge this? So do I leave you here? I think I have to for the gate to stay up. Sorry, lantern buddy. Maybe we'll find you again sometime. Is that a... That's a character. A very lanky one. Hush now, I think I hear something. The knights, are they back? They will be if you don't keep your trap shut. Am I interrupting something? Ah, oh, the, uh, they're back. Don't take me, take him. He's a thief and I'm just a helpless little joker. Uh, hey. What are you talking about? I'm not a knight and I'm definitely not after you. W wait a minute, she's the... the the heart. Heart? I guess I'm used to being called by all these different titles. I mean, back in Kimura, people would always refer to me as Keeper or Warden. And whatever did you do to earn such a collection of accolades? I was a priestess once, a long dream ago. A spiritual guide, I guess, but you can just call me Inna. And how can we be of service, Miss Keeper Warden Inna? Who are you? Ah, such an intimate question. Who are we? Are we the things we do? The things we feel? The things we eat, perhaps? Alright, Cheshire Cat, calm down. But I haven't eaten in ages. Actually, I was just asking your names. Our names have been taken from us a long time ago. But not to worry, I would much rather prefer Joker, as I mentioned, and go by these days. Then... That's... that one's the thief? It's the hands, you see. They can grasp anything but a notion of property. It's not my fault people leave stuff just lying around. Is that why you're trapped? Is that why you're trapped in those... cages? How do you know these bars are meant to keep us... How do you know these bars are meant to keep us in rather than keep you out? But don't you want to be free? I'm sure we can find a way to... There's safety behind bars. Belt hel birds held in captivity tend to outlive their wild counterparts. Uh. I never thought of it that way. Anything else? Ask away to your heart's content. Don't you get bored? Where are we? What's with these cells? Is this a prison? Th this is the dungeon. Well, this floor anyway. So the other floors are something else? I yes, the but the heart's not supposed to wander. Actually, I think that's what the heart's supposed to do. I'm just trying to find my way out of here. And you decided to ask the duo behind bars? What happened here? Everything's wrecked and broken. What happened here? The tower was under attack. Attack? It was an assault, a charge, a raid, an onslaught. That's what happened. Didn't you hear? I'm not sure. I think I was asleep, dreaming, really. You dreamed through the whole affair. Talk about a heavy sleeper. Yeah, I... I guess. Something else in that hearty head of yours. Is there a way out? I know this must be a weird question, but... Is there a way out of here? Out of the dungeons. Out of the tower. Please, I have to leave. I need to leave. <sighs> the only wants or needs that matter are the towers. Listen to her rumbling. She'll try to stop you every step of the way. But we can help each other out. Together, we can all be free of this place. Freedom, as you will soon realize, does not come cheap. I can't stay here. I need to go back to my village, to my papa. Whatever the price, I'll pay. Well, the heart wants what the heart wants, and if the heart wants to leave... She could talk to the architect. The architect? Who's that? She built this place. She knows the way. I have to find the architect. If the architect's the only way we, one who can... If the architect's the only one who can help, then please tell me where to find her. Why didn't you ask sooner? The exit's right ahead. C can't miss it. Alright. Later, dorks. Have fun staying in jail and having only each other's company for the rest of your lives. What happens if I pull this lever? An elevator, probably? Or a door? It's, it looks like a door. Oh, did I just free them? 
I don't think that was supposed to happen. Did I just read them? No, I did not. Oh, but this broke. Hey. Oh, Miss Cooper, Cooper Warden Inna broke the tower, did you? What should I do? Well, I'm no specialist, but I think you need to find yourself a flumai. A what? A flumai. Small beast-like machines. They were used to activate power stations. Like the one you just broke. The little critters used to roam the lower levels of the dungeon. He, he means down that opening. So what I have to do is find a flumai down there and connect it to that power station? Fast learner this hard, isn't she? Thank you. I know it's scary out here, but I promise I'll find a way to free you in your turn. Once again, I don't think they want to be freed, but all right. Save pointo? No. This is uh, just one of these boxes. I don't know why I thought it was a save point. The save points look totally different. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, no, there is a save point right here. There we go. There we go. Cool, cool. Now we just push this box under here. I didn't think it was a save point. For some reason, my mind just said save point. Maybe, maybe I subconsciously noticed the save point right there. But yeah, for some reason I had save point in my head when I meant to say, like, the lantern thing. You climb down that chain in a... I guess we could have just, like, jumped down. I wonder if there's a way to slide down it. Even though that would probably really, really hurt your hands. Alright, looks like I probably... I don't know if you can swim. Are you a water-soluble protagonist or not? These are the questions we must ask ourselves. Uh-huh. Swing, swing. And down, 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 down. Swing. A swing. There we go. Another checkpoint. So, do I want to go down there? Maybe I do. Oh, no, we can't we can't pull that out of there. So, I don't think this is where we were supposed to go. So, maybe we do fall down there. Oh, wait, is this a bunch of the stuff I can't Yeah, that's the stuff I can't walk past. Oh no. Do I have to kill Inna now? Well, I hope you're water soluble, otherwise I'm stuck. Okay, you are water soluble. Good to know. All right, let's get back to the checkpoint. Maybe I missed something over there. I probably did, otherwise I'm going to be very concerned about how I progress. Yeah, I was trying to pull it this way. I guess I could have just pushed it forward. Yeah, I saw it and I was like, oh, I can probably, I don't know. I was thinking of in like some games, you can only pull a block one direction and this looked like a shortcut that I come out of at some other point, but no. We're good, though. I'm just a little bit dumb. It's fine. Alright, so... Over here? How do I get up to you? I mean, there's a... There's a chain right there, but I don't think I can grab it. That I have to activate with the cube up there. Oh, the chain's connected to the box. Okay. Well, that solves my problem, doesn't it? We just gotta move the box back to a different spot. Alright, come here, you. You're gonna get pushed, and you're gonna like it. I think that's probably good. You can just drop down. Yeah, it doesn't seem like you really take fall damage. You just kind of, you know, brace your knees a bit because I make you snap them in half. Alright, so swing, big swings, just trying to build this up to max, I think that might be it, there we go, cool, 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 now we hop up here, and go down here, bang, and we are good, jumpy, jumpy, there was a door over- oh, wait! Door. This is right. I can't go that way because that way has the stuff blocking anyway. I need to push you over here to this pedestal so that we can light you up. Getting a bit ahead of myself there. 
Alright, so now that you're open, what do you do? Lead into nothing? Uh... Oh no. I don't... think that was supposed to happen? Oh god, yeah, no, that's not supposed to happen. Uh, last checkpoint, please. I fell through the world. That was not supposed to happen. I was like, this looks abruptly dark. And yeah, that was not supposed to be a thing. Okay, so... Yeah, now it loaded it. Okay, okay, that was weird. That was weird. But it, the game just came out. So, these things are to be expected. Alright, but it, it's loaded now. We're good. We are good. That that honestly terrified me. For a second I was like, wait, is this is this gameplay? And then I started falling and falling infinitely, and then, uh, and then the screen started freaking out. I was like, okay, this is not gameplay. What was that noise? Uh, I hate it. Can we not and say we did? Um, can you run a little bit faster, Inna? Your, your life is in danger. Maybe, like, do a full sprint instead of a jog. Okay, we're good. We're good. And jump. Oh, come on! Well, jeez. Well, now you're just gonna be very, very pissed off at me because I made you fall down a cliff. Impale yourself on the boat saw? Unfortunately, no. Haha! -ha. I thought maybe you wouldn't like this. Haha, -ha, dork. Must suck to hate light. That was just like that dream. Oh, yeah, we're gonna be experiencing your dreams. With the eyes in the dark and life growing all wrong. It can't be this way. Yeah, we're gonna be experiencing all of your dreams and nightmares. What a cool idea for a game. That is really neat. Like, your dreams become manifest and you have to travel through them. I love that. Your dreams are now just the real world. Alright, hello. A spirit? You were calling to me, weren't you? Navi? I still hear the growling. Oh! Okay, giant robot with buzzsaw hands. It's a spirit of energy. I knew I could feel something all the way down here, but I never thought it would lead me to such power. Hi. Uh-huh. Can I, like, talk to you or something? Uh, you don't seem too terribly interested in me. I'm pressing X, it doesn't look like I can grab you out of that thing. I think we're good. Yeah, I think we're good. Uh, never mind. I think I need that. How do I get you, though? What am I supposed to do here? I thought I would just, like, kind of grab you out of this thing, but... I can't... I'm pressing, like, all the buttons. Can't seem to interact with you in any way. But I need something to power that thing down there. Oh! What's this? Oh, this is just the... Okay. I saw a giant beam of light and I was like, what is that? Just, uh, that thing. Hmm. So what am I supposed to be doing here? A bit confused, I'd say. Hmm. Hello? Let's see here. Did I do something? Oh, here we go. Okay, I, I, I pressed X and Y and something happened. Huh. Weird. I thought I tried pressing X on it earlier to pick it up, but it wasn't working. Just calm down now. Remember, Papa. Remember your training. Okay, I, the Keeper of Kimura. That's it, yeah. Huh. I, the Keeper of Kimura, request your virtue. Grant me the power of energy. Maybe I was coming at it from a diff from the wrong side or something? At that time I was coming at it from the right side. I did it! 
I am the keeper of Kimura. Papa will be so proud. He... He would be. Let's find the way home. Yeah, Papa's not around anymore. Alright. Well, we did that. <clears throat> okay, it is Y. You have to press Y on them. I thought it would be X, because X has been the interact button for, like, most of this, but... I guess Y is, like, our button to use our magic power or something. Alright, well, I think this is probably a pretty good spot to go ahead and end this first episode off, so... This has been really, really neat so far. A lot of beautiful art, some pretty cool music. One bug, but it was really funny. <laughs> I was just like, oh my god! But, yeah, so... This has been pretty cool so far. I'm interested in seeing what else we got. We got an interesting story and everything, so... I hope you've enjoyed this first episode of... It was Inna's Memories, right? Aspire Inna's Memories, I believe is what it's called. So, yeah. I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for some more.